Hey guys, welcome back to Final Fantasy Brief XVS. Today will be a perfect build for Kingdom Hearts Sephiroth for me anyway. You guys, many of you guys love him and many of you guys may get lucky and grab him. I just relieved uh, relieved on all of his skill so basically Sephiroth is just OP guys let's have to go back to the skill real quick so in my opinion his skill is based on this ability as uh, 1110 okay what does it do basically it gives you physical damage up 10 times multiply ignore 50% defense AOE rewind for one turn okay so I'm look at this and it's use limit burst stone I'm like um how can I make this every single turn how is it possible? It's cost 50 stone. Okay, it's cost 50 stone. So, I just found a solution, guys. So, basically, this build is just for a support Sephiroth that do plenty of damage. His buff of 250%, 200% all limit burst fill rate. Okay, his attack can go up to 3,273, okay? This will distract you from my talking. <laughs> I'm pretty sure there's a lot of rainbow in there, okay? Um, anyway, guys, look at this, guys. In every turn, he will get limit burst per turn of 35 stone with this build. If you like this kind of build, it's not easy, guys. It's like in in game or super well or maybe in like a six month or a year that you will acquire this. Even me, I don't have it. Okay, I don't have all of it, but I have some of it. That is possible for me to get it. Okay, so how how is it work to get thirty five stone? So basically, if in the FFBE equip, I have to say thank you. If I don't have this, I don't know how to calculate them. So it said that expected LB shed per turn. If there's none, he will get only five limit burst stone. Okay? So if there is one, you know the red thing drop to him, it will become 12. If it's two, it become 20. Three, it's become 20, 27. Four, it become 35. And then you might ask me, hey X. Why, 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 why? 35 is not enough, man. It's, it's cannot do every turn. It's, it's cost 48. Oh, I thought it's 40. <laughs> Actually, it, we need 5. Apologize. Okay? We have 42, right? 42. And when you cast one of the ability, this one, okay? It will give you 5 stone to cast the. So basically, it's 10. Okay? So 10. Plus 42, that's 50. So 52, if you go 4, is 45. I need a little bit more. So maybe, yeah, 5 stone. So this is the trick to do it. So it might be like every 2 turn. But is it good enough? I think it's good enough. Okay? Um, but because it's heavily, heavily built on limit burst of fuel aid, guys. You know this already. So how do I build them? Okay? As you can see, right? With this build, I have two slot open okay why do I leave this two slot open normally if you go to fight to any boss like beast bird dragon uh, machine plan whatever it is you should put one of the killer effect for example I just go from a uh, man killer man killer and what the hell man eater what okay man eater right yeah, that's how you how you do it. Okay, man eater and dear bro. Okay, you know you know this simple stuff already. To do the damage, I just found out in, in this game. Why you go so small man? Um one second guys. So as you know that on this game, right? I, I test it, I do calculation a lot of time. Killer do more damage than attack okay for example you have 250 percent buff it's not equivalent to like one 250 of um killer effect okay you need like 500 or 600 to become able to do the same damage so i leave this two alone okay so if you if you put more of the limit burst fuel aid you can get even more less than this i think three minimum three stone 
If you get three stone, you get auto revive every turn. If you have two Cerberus, you can rotate them one by one, okay? To be able to do auto revive. And why is good? Your healer will have three times. You don't care about this spell, you don't care about anything, debuff or whatever, you just debuff me, no problem. I will just auto revive everyone again. And buff, yeah, put me core or something in it, okay? It's a perfect, perfect build for me, anyway. Right, let's have a look at the, what do I get, what do I build him for, okay? So I build him with uh, Masamune from Sabra Super Chirma. This hat from uh, Lucius, if you don't have it. The other option is to put Sino hat, guys. Sino hat give you limit burst fill it, okay? See, there's only two items in the game, okay? That can give you limit burst fill it. One is um, Sino hat and the other one is Royal Cow. So, because Royal Cow is for Mage, if you go for Mage build, you can do this to anyone, any collector in the game, guys. Mage support, you use this one, okay? Um, or, or you can use a Sino hat as well, okay? And for the, 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 the armor, I use a Regan. There's not many, there's only two items as well, okay? One is Super TMR from Regan, one is Super TMR from Seaside Nicole, okay? This is the only two that give you 50% limit burst fill it. You can put any of those, but this one gives you more damage. Next is X13, okay? X13 is the best super team, guys. It's keep 100% limit burst fill rate with 60 attack. This is top tier in game stuff. I have like two 100% Mugo waiting for something. So at first I'm gonna get like what, um, Alena. Then I gotta uh, and I come out. Ah, I want Kaito. Okay, I want uh, evade 30%. Then I'm like, oh, why do I want 30%? I can just 100%, just less damage because um don't care. Okay, because um because all the accessory are bad with evade anyway, so don't really need it. So I hold them off, and then I'm like, whoa! I check in Japan. This is the best stuff you can get, man. Even in Japan, this is the best limit burst fill it. However, guys, that that is a poor man version as well. Is for you to get. You should. Uh, you should. Some you might have it. Is Axa normal TMR give you fifty. Okay, and through double hand as well. This might be the best. Okay, so you lost only one hundred percent limit burst fill rate. So is I think it's fine. You can put two of the uh, Arc Star in there. Okay, but let's see. Let's see how much. How many turn do we need? Uh, I mean, how many stone do we need to acquire? 48 limit burst stone okay so if you put those in then let me finish first and then we go to the th the other three one is buster style to get the cap off um now i'm over cap though so that's fine uh, but but you can swap you can do whatever you like you can remove one of this and you grab x13 super tmr okay or you can grab this one this one is from really from free it's basically from free it's three on 3MR from 3 star, okay? And you get X13, you put in there, and what else? And it's a how Hero Wow Dark from um from TMR from Reagan, okay? This gives you a katana as well, 30% attack and limit burst fill rate of 50. And now the best part of all is Super TMR from Tidus, guys. Tidus, uh, if you see my uh, last video. Um, if you see the last video, right? You know that Tidus is common drop rate. I have like top top four character is one one of them: Tidus, Emperor, um, the the chicken guy, Wilhelm, and one of the other guy. I forgot the name. All right, it's give one fifty limit burst fill it. Okay, so this is the one that you will have. Okay, so basically you need six if you go this build. You you go for poor man. You need six, but you need a little bit more. You need one more. Okay, you don't okay but because you get ten from you know the skill up that you cast. Okay, and if if you feel like if you feel like hey my Sapphire Icon is for support, I don't have all this gear. I can you can swap any sword, guys. Any sword, change the shirt to a uh, Sapphire shirt. This one okay should be fine. All right. If you feel like you need more, you can put hero something on it. Okay. All the worldly tasks give you limit burst fill rate, guys. So basically, hero of the dark. Hilo of the fire, Hilo of the light, Hilo of the water, Hilo of the light. 
Yeah, that, that means the light from Citra or something, you see? 50, 50, 50, 50, okay? You can get all of them. However, your damage will drop, okay? Your damage will drop, or light is here. Okay, so what do I need to put? I just put um, this one in. So this one is the best. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, you can put a chocobo thing as 100. This one for 100. I think 150 in cho Mama Chocobo, you can get that. And if you need more stone, you can go for Carbango. Carbango give you uh, one limit burst stone as well, guys. So increase limit burst, get each turn for one, all right? So now it's come up total of 54. That's too much. Okay, it's 5, 45, still too much. 4 is 37. This is roughly a, a, a good number, okay? So you need one Super Chima from X13. I can grab this right now, and then I can do this build. And then I can have like every single turn, guys. I'm pretty sure 4 stone or 3 stone is not a big, big deal to me to get an auto rewind every single turn, okay? And uh, if you have Serena, okay, this chick, the, the, the green chick there, Serena give you free one limit burst stone every single turn. It will fix your problem as well. It's a passive ability, guys. So this is how I feel about Sephiroth, how you build him to get um, um, AOE revive every single turn, okay? Some of you may not disagree this is not a good build. Yes, of course, this is perfect. It's a perfect build, trust me, for my team, not for your team. Okay, for your team, you can do something else. Okay, this will do massive damage. Okay, look at that, massive damage. High HP, 11k is, is fine. Okay, um, um, what is it called? MP is really high, 1000. I'm pretty sure in the story mode, you can just click order. Not you cannot click auto because it's not limit burst. <laughs> Apologize. So basically, you can just like do it every single turn. All right. So it should be fine for most tri boss. Uh, because like this in this day, tri boss can like dispel and everything. It's not that good though. But I feel like because I want to make him work. Okay. I love Sephiroth. I love Kingdom Heart Cloud. I gotta put those two together and just make a Kingdom Heart three team. Okay, so anyway guys, I hope you enjoy this. I might be missing something. If you guys know any better build that than I do, okay, let me know guys. More damage, okay? More damage is always good. But everyone, you, you guys know, a lot of them can do a lot of damage. 11 can do a ton of damage, you know. Um, King Rain coming up, Mama Thing coming out. Mama, what is it called? I don't know, man. They, they just like destroy everyone. But those are uh, festival summon, which I don't think I would go for that. Okay, well, uh, none of them, maybe except only one character is a Mama character. That's all I want. Or maybe Cecil. No, no, yeah, I want all of them. <laughs> but we will see. We will see how it works. If it's like come as a bad deal, I don't think I will spend any more money in this game. This may be last time in this year that I will spend money on it. Maybe, maybe. If they put like super demon demon rain, okay, like super instinct, I mean demon rain on it, and uh, and like it's good, and here's a tank, I might do it. All right, guys, I talked too much already. Uh, that's it for me today on Kingdom Heart Cloud. I hope you enjoy this for uh, limit burst build, and this work for every character in the game, guys. I just check every limit burst character in the game, and I. I having fun, trust me, okay? Trust me, it's a fun build to do limit burst every turn, okay? Trust me, all right? It's fun, fun thing. Anyway, guys, this is it for me, and I will see you guys next time. You guys have a good weekend, guys. Bye-bye.